who are to be guided from the darkness into the light, and from the light into darkness. Azura has seen your coming, traveler. It was not curiosity, but fate that has led you here. Azura has given me the gift of foresight. I had a vision of you walking up the steps to this altar long before you were born. You have been chosen to be her champion. I know it is unexpected, but do not worry. It will all unfold as she has predicted. You must go to a fortress endangered by water, yet untouched by it. Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. It is cryptic, I know, but Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Ask if they know this elven enchanter. May Azura's magic protect you. That's it. Got to go. Okay, let's put this into context. Uh, there aren't anyone in that cave that alive anymore. That aren't fallen. along behind me. Who sent you? Was it the college? The Yarrow? We agreed there would be no more questions. You're working with the Daedra? Right. Now tell me the one about the Argonian maid and the lusty baron. Just calm down. I'll tell you everything. What do you know about soul gems? They are, except the gem is always consumed. They're frail, except for one. Azura's Star, a Daedric artifact that allows any number of souls to pass through it. Some of us wanted to find out how. I was working under Malin Varan then. If only we knew what he was really planning. Malin wanted to alter the star. He was dying, disease. He thought he could store his own soul inside, become immortal. It drove him mad. Students started dying. Eventually, the college exiled him. He took a few loyal disciples to Ilan Alter's Deep and vanished. Look, I don't care who asked you to find the star, but don't take it back to Azura. The Daedra are evil. They're the reason Malin went insane. I mentioned how the star is a soul gem. 
only it never gets depleted. There's another rule the artifact follows. You can only store white souls in the star belonging to the lesser creatures. Azura's magic won't allow black souls to enter it. As a mortal, Malin's soul was black, so part of his work was breaking past Azura's rules. He was close before. Well, I already told you. Azora is no ordinary Daedra. She commands an entire realm inside of Oblivion. The more Malin worked on the star, the more she was able to damn him. It started slowly at first. Malin would see things that weren't there. Then he would yell at students over words they hadn't said. Then one day I walked in and Malin had killed a student. And in a horrific moment of inspiration, he started using her soul for his work. The college would agree with you, but do you have any idea how many innocent lives were cut short just so Azura could have revenge? We're nothing to the Daedra. Pawns to move around, praise and punish as they see fit. <coughs> the college would... We're nothing to the Daedra. No. Gods no, not for years. I left Winterhold for some time and returned to stay here at the inn. I still have research that keeps me busy, and being here in Winterhold ensures I have access to former colleagues. Okay. All right then. That was Nelikar and all of his dialogue options. Yes, I'm pretty sure he has. There's nothing else he's used for. I know exactly where this is, by the way. Yeah, in this water area. If there's one thing I remember from this game, it's where the Azura Star is, because of how strong that thing is. A soul gem that has no limit. Except, you know, black souls. I can always come back. <laughs> Remember that sound? Uh, I was just congestion in my nose. I think that's the right word. Oh my God. No. that you fear. Fuck Wait, can you not land? No, fuck, fuck him. I'm just gonna go back to my, go to my house and drop off everything. In my chest. That 
snap around. Oh, it just works. Very mad to into the house. Mother of <laughs> genuine anger. <laughs> what are you looking at, Felix? I think he's trying to learn his name. He twitches ears. Hmm. Well, he twitches ears after I said his name. Felix. <laughs> he looked at me. Good. Achievement for like visiting all the all the stones. Yeah, I'm just gonna jump out of the water. Yeah, that's that's how physics works. Thing about the lover, not, not the lady. The lady does that instead of what I'm thinking of. Because I have the lover stone. Power, right?
Yeah, there you go. Gotcha crap of mud. That was infinitely difficult. Oh my god, I'll never recover. Okay, let's move on. Hello, Mitten. You are also here. But I need to play video game. <laughs> oh, you you aren't actually a thing. You aren't in the interact. Yeah, that's how physics. <laughs> that's how physics work. Yeah, totally. I don't know what I just picked up, and I don't care enough to uh, search my entire inventory to find it. Oh, you want out? Oh, I might as well be. I'll, I won't try looking for skill books. The chances of me finding some of them is very low, considering I've uh, got over half of them already. Oh, eggs for something that doesn't make an appearance in uh, Skyrim. This rock warbler. achievement. I am a master.
Yeah, why not? Crits with this aren't wouldn't be that bad. Oh my god, pow, 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 fuck. Ew, there's a spine on the table. That grody. I didn't see the stairs. I used a shrub because I thought it was the only way across for me. Also, I thought I was being very clever. I mean, I probably was, but eh. How the hell did they build this place? I understand that it's falling into the, into the lake, but how did- why? Why- why did it fall into the lake? And why is it still so intact, regardless of that fact? 
You think it'd be more dis oh this place be this place would be more f oh smashed considering it's collapsing into a lake. But no, just some parts of the place is underwater. Like, I don't understand how they did this. That's weird. Just this. Like, where does this go? Where? Out to the poison. Profit was a good investment in over three hours of work. I need to try pickpocketing more often you know, against uh, enemies in buildings like this. Dungeons, whatever. It'll help me towards the, uh, the thief achievement, or whatever it's called. Pickpocketing is the only thing I haven't done for that achievement. The Grimoire. The Grimoire. Just, 
just completely dissolves into its insanity. Okay, so in this unmodified game, the Black Star is better, but it's. Eh. This is an unmodded series, besides the paid mods, so. Going with Nelicar would actually be the better idea because the Black Star is more powerful. Uh, because, uh. I'll set black souls. Serve the yarl, not waste time talking. Stendar's mercy, you found it. Azora's star. Maybe this is my chance to make things right. I can finish Malin's work the way we had meant to before his madness. It would mean cutting the star off from Azora. Only black souls would be able to enter it once we finished. Give me a minute to examine the star. I'll see what we'll need to do. The 
these fissures and cracks aren't encouraging. Malin obviously was growing more desperate once he left the college. Hmm. He did it. He actually managed to trap his own soul inside the star, but it's falling apart. It needs more and more souls to sustain itself. The star is being used to sustain Malin's soul. I can't fix it while that fragment of him is inside. He's already dead. Worse, the enchantment keeping him intact requires black souls. I don't know how many people he must have killed. If we don't do something, the enchantment will eventually fade and the star will slip back into oblivion. Azora will have the last laugh. Precisely. But it's not as simple as enchanting Malin away. He's put up barriers. Souls are only allowed in, not out. If we were to somehow send a soul inside the star, one that was ready to overpower Malin from the inside, a special type of soul trap, placing you inside the star without fully killing you. Once Malin has been dealt with, I'll bring you back. I understand if you need some time to prepare. Let me know when you're ready. Hmm, never thought about it. But I guess in this game, well, in, in this series, that uh, you are your soul. Like, uh, he sends you into the thing with your soul. And I have full control, so in this game, the consciousness probably is the soul. In the body. Hmm. Wait. People that get soul trapped, they get sent to Soul Karen. But I never get sent. It must be because the people die when being soul trapped. Why doesn't he show up in. He's soul trapped, is it? Eh. Malin's soul should be in the star. Theoretically, purging him will be just like killing a ghost anywhere else. I'll have a magical tether to your soul while you're inside. Once you're done, it'll be as simple as pulling you back into your body. Malin's soul is beyond hope because his body is dead. But I'll be keeping you just slightly alive on this end. But be careful. If you die inside the star, your soul will be disrupted. There's nothing anyone can do for you if that happens. Okay, stand very still. This might sting. First, I'm going to ah! grab hold of your soul. Now, take a deep breath. Ah, my disciples have sent me a fresh soul. Good. I was getting hungry. Why? There's something different about you. And who are you to challenge me? I have conquered mortality itself. I've spat in the eyes of the Daedric Lords. This is my realm now. I've sacrificed too much to let you take it from me. Clever little scum lord. Did he just absorb? That's annoying. Why do you always have
That's fucking bullshit. I'm a vampire, of course I'm fucking weak to this bullshit. Hmm. There's only one reason I die, and become a vampire. Hmm. Unless you're bringing me Stand enough up. around. Maybe this is... It would mean cutting the star off from... Give me a minute to examine the star. I'll see what we'll need to do. These fissures and cracks aren't encouraging. Malin obviously was growing more desperate once he left the college. You fucking suck, Nick's Hound. I hate you. You are the worst of the free things I think I got. I can't kill you either, so that sucks. Hmm. He did it. He actually managed to trap his own soul inside the star, but it's falling apart. It needs more and more souls to sustain itself. The star is being used to sustain Malin's soul. Precisely. But it's not as if we were to somehow. I could soul trap you, place you inside the star, then bring you back. I understand if you need some time to prepare. Okay, stand very still. This might. St First, I'll need to grab the of your soul. Now, take a deep breath. Ah, why? There's something different about you. And who are you? This is my realm now. I won't let you take it from me. That's it. That's all you've got. No, not like this. Yes, Malin's like... enchantments are broken. Hold on. I'm going to pull your soul out of there. Brace yourself. I swear to God, it's because I. Oh, it's disgusting. Okay, so that was the Azura Star quest. I mean, technically, it was also the Black Star quest. But eh. What? I don't want to be hurt again. What? Okay, I was going to end the recording right here, but that question note of, that's really close. What are they doing away from uh, right, White Run? Run of White. 
Uh, that's uh, best keep that joke uh, quiet. Yeah, that's uh, not how quest markers are supposed to work. Uh... Well then, um, I'm gonna be here before I find anything else weird.